Hey, it's the Plumbing Gurus. We're back with another video. Today we're going to talk to you guys about how to replace the cartridge on a bathroom faucet. Does your faucet at home look like this? Constantly running, dripping, annoying you, costing you money? Well, keep watching this video. We'll help you fix it. Okay, so the first thing you want to do is you want to make sure you shut the water off uh, either underneath the sink. If you do not have uh, shutoffs underneath the sink, you want to shut your water off to the main. Let's go take a look and see where the main is. So in this case, we have shutoffs underneath the sink. So come on over, and I'll show you guys how to shut those off. All right, so we'll shut these off. For you guys that don't know, the left is always hot, and the right is always cold. Okay, so now we got the water off to the tap. We're gonna make sure that there is no water that comes out, because it can be disastrous if you still have the water on and you take your cartridge out, water is going to come flying out of here. So it's always good to make sure. All right, so here what we're going to do, we're going to pull up the stopper just in case we drop something down there. This is a fancy, almost like a screw handle Allen key, but this is a 3 32nd um, Allen key. What we'll do is we'll just unscrew the set screw. Now you don't have to go all the way out. And this is a Delta faucet. So we're going to take both handles out. Now, it might have been just the hot that was the cartridge was failing, but if you're going to change one um, of the cartridges, I don't see why you wouldn't just change them both. Okay, so now what we're going to do. We're going to take the nuts off the cartridges here. Right. Just like that. And then we'll grab. Oh, there it is. And we'll just pull up and wiggle very gently back and forth, just like that. Okay, so now that we've got new cartridges, we use a little bit of plumber's grease. We'll just put those around the O-rings. It's always nice to do. Like that. We can grease off the fingers. Slide the cartridge to the little notch on the side there. Just slide it right in. Slide this notch right into the valve. Just like that. Okay, now the cartridge is seated nicely. We're gonna put the nuts on top. Like that. Nice finger tight. For now. Got a nice adjustable wrench here. You don't have to go crazy tight on these. You can always check for leaks after. If it does, Tighten them just like that. And there we go. And put the handles on just like that. Handles on. Grab our fancy little Allen key screwdriver. These just little set screws, you don't have to go crazy tight on them. Just level up nicely. Voila! Here we go. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna turn the water on underneath the sink here. That's a good sign, no more drips. Hold it. Okay. 
respect for any leaks. Looks pretty good. We are good. All right, guys. So this video that Clayton was doing here was uh, pretty generic. So sometimes if your faucet isn't a delta like we had here, a nice simple one, uh, you just have to kind of shop around and find your brand. You can take a picture of it, take it into your local plumbing shops. Most most plumbing shops will be able to help you and tell you what kind you need. That's right, that's right. And not all cartridges are going to be the same. So if you got like a Growy or um, just a, a different... What is Growy, Kohler, Delta, Moen, don't buy Price Fist or Header. <laughs> it's just what, what we're saying is it might not come apart the same and it might not get put back together the exact same as the video we have. So exactly. if you guys have any taps that you have that you want to get a little bit more information or maybe get us to do a tutorial video on how to change those, that we'd be more than happy to do that for you guys. Yeah, so Just leave, leave some comments below yeah. and don't forget to subscribe. That's right. And we are the Plumbing Gurus. <laughs> Check you later.